Rough start. I think that's a good length. But I do think we should rehearse some sword fighting and stuff with and see what happens, how, how far they... We don't want them to get in the way. Nice, huh? My name is Ahmed. I play Jar Jar. Judy's going to be dressing you. Ah. He's going to be... <laughs> We're pursuing the idea of uh, doing the Jar Jar body on the set and the head in the digital. Depends on how they do that suit. You want to walk through this? Sure. Here is the sad news. Well, but interesting news. At, at first glance, we might think there's a large chunk to be saved from um, Jar Jar in a suit. But looking at all the shots that he's in, mm -hmm. um, which is 461, the difference of the approach we would take without a suit mm -hmm. versus doing a suit is about a million three. Well, a million saved is a million earned. Are the ears going to be on that, too? No, they don't want to use. Oh, it's going to be put through a whole series of movements. Oh, really? Yes, I mean, the works, so that they have everything they can possibly try to track. So if the suit gets damaged, don't worry about it. The guy we got has got a great walk and everything, and when he translated into Jar Jar, it was great. The thing is, though, one of the things that could make this thing the most special thing in the world is that it is a pure CG character. But well, what we're trying to do in the end is speed up the animation. We have the guy anyway. Yeah. We're shooting the guy anyway. So if you have the guy in the suit, it costs you the aggravation of how does he stand it in the suit, the wear and tear in the suit, does it look good? Him getting it out this, of the suit. This, yeah, no, I know, but yeah. at the end, that's all that stuff. But what you gain is that there are moments where he interacts with humans and everything, which cut well, costs very was... fast. One of the purposes of this, well, the purpose of this test is to see what the head attachment is really going to be like, and it's been brought up as a concern that we may need to have some additional tracking marks further out because we have to match the shoulders as well to actually do that blend so that as there's some shoulder movement, we need to be replicating that so that our blend actually blends. So the important thing to get data on is, is around the neckline and uh, potentially around the shoulders too. And when you walk, because now we're going to be in a wide figure, Again, you know, the, the sort of loose arms that kind of don't have much in them. You know. John knows this movement, too. Yeah, that's, we're yeah. trying to take care of uh, this one. Turn over, please. And speed in. And plop down. Yeah, look around, kind of. Okay, now look at the camera, and you see something. Oh, my gosh. Okay. But looks good, actually. Yeah, it's pretty sort amazing, of, actually. You sort of uh, imagine filling you know, in sort of, the space. Yeah, you sort of fill in the space and sort of look at it without your glasses. It looks pretty good. All done real soon now. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be a little tight. Well, that's uh, good. Can be okay? Mm -hmm. All right. That looks good. All right, you're suited up. Ready? Ready for it. Okay, everyone, let's start with a brief warm up. We're going to start with a stretch. If, if we could just use your performance, there's no need to keyframe animate it. Where you're, even your characters are sort of standing in the background, you do these great things where you're, you're moving and your hands are like that. If we can capture that, then we don't have to animate them. We can just take those and stick those into different scenes. <laughs> Got it. George pioneered this. So should this. I start this just by walking this way? Yeah. Mostly it's a slow realization of what you got right. connected to. Yeah. First it's kind of an annoying, like you stepped in dog doo and that kind of... And then you realize what it is, and then you try to get away from it. Right. You try to run over here, and you're And the, the, the cannon itself is not moving very far. SW1 shot, GBJJ14A. 